Susie and me jump up and down in muddy puddles? No, Pepper. You were babies. You couldn't even walk. Oh. What did we do? <laughs> you cried. <laughs> you burped. <laughs> and you laughed. <laughs> we were babies. Baby Susie. Baby Pepper. <laughs> Goo goo gaga, goo goo gaga. <laughs> Soon after that, you were toddlers. <laughs> and where was George? He was a baby in my tummy. <laughs> yes, you were in my tummy, George. You've got a big tummy, Daddy. Is there a baby in there? Oh, oh no, Peppa. This tummy is pure muscle. <laughs> <laughs> The secret of making a good pancake is to flip it high into the air. <laughs> a one, two, three, hoopla! <gasps> Silly Daddy. Oh, maybe that was just a bit too high. Oh, what a shame. That was the last pancake. It should be a simple matter to get it down. <sighs> oh dear. Daddy Pig cannot just pancake. Don't worry, Daddy Pig. I think I know a way to get it down. Let's go upstairs, children. <laughs> this way. What is Mummy Pig planning to do? On the count of three, we all have to start jumping up and down. One, two, three, jump! <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> It worked. Now Daddy Pig has his pancake. Daddy has a pancake on his head. Oh. <laughs> Syrup on your pancake, Daddy Pig? Yes, please. <laughs> One, two, three. Hoopla! <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> It's an overgrown weed. 
I should have cut it down years ago. Grandpa, why don't you like it? I don't like the way it looks at me. Silly Grandpa, it's just a harmless bush. And it's covered in lovely blackberries. George has seen some really big, juicy blackberries. Mm. Careful, George, or you might get tangled. <laughs> I have a stick for being hard to reach blackberries. <laughs> Clever, Grandpa. But the best blackberries are right at the very top. That's why I brought the ladder. Um, don't lean too far over, Mummy Pig. Don't worry. I've been climbing this blackberry bush since I was a little girl. Yes, but you're not a little girl now. It's fallen into the blackberry bush. Mummy, can you get out? Uh, no, I'm stuck. You're stuck in a thorny bush like Sleeping Beauty. What? Once upon a time, there was a princess called Sleeping Beauty. One day, she fell asleep in a thorny bush. And she stayed there for a hundred years. Yes, that's a nice story, Peppa. <laughs> Peppa Pig. Daddy Pig's old accordion. I used to play this to Mummy Pig when we first met. Oh, Daddy Pig. I remember this tune. <laughs> George wants to play the accordion too. Are you sure, George? The accordion is quite difficult. George, the accordion is almost as difficult to play as my drum. Okay, George. <laughs> oh. Maybe George is a bit too little to play the accordion. Daddy, what other instruments are in the box? Just this horn. Can I try? You have to blow it very hard. <gasps> that does not sound right. It's impossible. I think I used to be able to play it. <gasps> that really does not sound right. <laughs> Maybe it just needs someone big and strong like me. <sighs> That does not sound right either. <sighs> Peppa's right. It is impossible to play. Never mind, Daddy Pig. Just stick to the accordion. You play it beautifully. <laughs> well, I do play it quite nicely, even if I say so myself. And I'll play my violin. And I will play my drum. Mummy Pig plays the violin. Daddy Pig plays the accordion. Peppa plays the drum. But what instrument will George play? <laughs> George is blowing the horn. Mummy couldn't play the horn. And Daddy couldn't play it. And even I couldn't play it. But George can play it. <laughs> <laughs> As well as seeing Chloe, you are going to meet your new cousin. Ooh. Peppa and her family have arrived at Chloe's house. Hello. Hello, Hello everyone. Hello, Peppa and George. This is Chloe, Peppa and George's... Ooh. The new cousin is a tiny baby piggy. <laughs> oh, how beautiful. Is it a girl, baby? No, it's a boy. Oh, I wish it was a girl. Me too. <laughs> George is pleased the baby is a boy. Dinosaur. Ah. I think the baby's too little to play with dinosaurs. George, the baby doesn't want to play with you. It wants to play with me. <laughs> Peppa, the baby is much too little to play ball games. But if it can't play with a dinosaur or a ball, what can it do? It eats and it sleeps. <laughs> and it does that. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie Pig, can I hold the baby? Yes, if you're very careful, you can hold Alexander. Alexander? That's his name, Baby Alexander. What a big name for such a small piggy. It's quite nice, even though it's a boy. Goo, goo, goo. Oh, what's that smell? Maybe Alexander's nappy needs changing. <laughs> Disgusting. Pepper, when you were a baby, you wore nappies. I did not. Pepper <laughs> <laughs> Pig. Post! <laughs> Special delivery for Miss Pepper Pig and 
Master George. What is it? It's a toy cupboard. Oh, it looks a bit flat. Yes, you built it yourself. Oh. Don't worry, Pepper. It'll be very easy for your mummy and daddy to build. Goodbye. Bye bye. 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 bye, -bye. Now what do we do? Now we build your toy cupboard. Yes. <laughs> That's strange. There aren't any instructions. Maybe it's so easy to build, it doesn't need instructions. Mummy, can we help? Yes. First, I need a shelf. <laughs> Here's a green shelf. Thank you, Peppa. Now I need four legs. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four. Four blue legs, Mummy. Lovely. We'll have this done in no time. Here's a red door, Mummy Pig. Thank you, Daddy Pig. There, finished. Well done, Mummy Pig. It's very tiny. How will all our toys fit inside? It is a little small. Oh, George has found another bit. Uh, maybe that's a spare shelf. And there's all of these bits too. Oh dear, the cupboard is tiny because Mummy Pig has not used all the pieces. We'll just have to take it apart and... Yeah. Sometimes I get so mad there's no control in me My thoughts get so bad I'm like I might grab a bat I don't know My wrath my blood boils over like Oh God here goes I lost all feeling from my head to my toes You said some shit that I can't let go So just stay tuned for the rest of the show So have you ever felt betrayed? Switches how you see things Realize something needs change Cause I know you got me up. Let me show you what's up Cause enough is enough I'll take a face full of pavement Just to make a statement I know there's no turning back Oh God, adrenaline wasted So mad I can taste it I know there's no turning back I'll do what it takes I ain't making mistakes like that Somewhere nice to wear it. What's this? Two tickets to the theatre tonight. 
Thank you. <sniffs> Mummy Pig loves going to the theatre. And Granny Pig and I are going to babysit the little ones. <laughs> what a super birthday. I'm the luckiest mummy in the whole world. And the most beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Now the snowman needs a nose. Pepper has got a carrot to make the snowman's nose. <laughs>